<laughs> some of the interesting things that have happened. I feel happened like you would just make me. me worry about you more, Jay. <laughs> yeah, no, no, but I, I would just say, I would just, I'm not going to call, I'm not going to go too deep into it. I would just say, I've had very interesting experiences shipping out of Colombia, okay? And uh, you really, really, I mean, it, it's, uh, it's a beautiful country. They're beautiful people. I love them. But it, it is, uh, it, at times, it's very, very hard to, uh, to do uh, uh, business uh, out of there. But this is, uh, the nephrite jade is really, really rare. Uh, even the, the cost of that, of that natural jade, and that, that's the key. That is the natural color of that nephrite jade, that deep emerald green. Mm. Uh, it goes amazingly with that green amber. Unfortunately, both materials are, are very, very hard to come by. Yeah, I mean, when I saw this, it's just absolutely incredible. And I feel like when you wear this out, people will say, you know, what what is that? And like, no, it's genuine jade. These, this is a jade necklace with green amber. And people, it's not like a, it's not common. It's so uncommon and just gorgeous and rare and beautiful and just the colors. And then the sparkle to it as well. You can see it sparkle. And by the way, this is one of the ones I know, Jay and I say this all the time, but really on this piece, when you open open up the box at home and you take it out like in the sunlight or, or just in your own home and you see it in front of you and you see how the jade is sparkling. Like you can see it a little bit in the studio, but the sparkle and the twinkle and just the richness and there's something magical about jade. There's entire culture's wealth are circling and, you know, centered around jade. So in Asian countries. Here, it's it's just really, I mean, you see jade, you go to a museum and you'll see pieces with jade in it, like this kind of jade. It's, it's really just gorgeous. It's not something you would ever see like in a local jewelry store or at the mall or even even at even like at a high jeweler. You you would, I mean, I went to the Plaza Vendôme in Paris when I went to Paris because I we talk about jewelry all the time and I couldn't wait. I saw, there was zero jade. Like it wasn't something that you would probably only see it in a museum where they had existed and things like that. It really isn't something that's easily accessible to m most, like to you and I. So I'm a huge fan of this piece, Jay. Okay, well, uh, I will tell you right now, this, this when we had it on, it's taken us, it's uh, right at three years to actually bring it back. You're, you're looking at new material. We had a few left in inventory. Um, they wanted to reorder this. Very, We do very few reorders, okay? It's not something that we normally do. Mm -hmm. Um, there's actually very few things that we can reorder in most cases, so that, that's why we don't do a lot of reorders. But this right here was one of the things, this combination that blew out. They wanted to do it as a Today Special. We told them there's just no way. But just to bring back the few that we were able to bring back in this has taken us years, not months, okay, years, years to mm -hmm. get it. And that was to be able to get the green, the green we had the knee fright in stock, but to be able to get the green amber from Columbia, that's where the, the, you know, the hang up was to be able to get that. We got just enough rough in to do these beads to be able to complete the necklaces that we wanted to do. Yeah, and, and maybe you're feeling, you know, optimistic about the world, and maybe you're going to be doing some traveling this summer for the first time in a year, year and a half. Uh, I know I am next week. Um, my daughter and I, Jay, we're going on a road trip together. So um, my 21-year-old daughter and I are going to do sort of like an East Coast driving tour. <laughs> we'll see what happens. I'll, I'll be posting on Instagram about it. I'll, I'll Instagram live. We'll see how we'll see how it goes if we're still speaking at the end of the trip. But but it's like you feel like you feel like you just there's something about this green color that's like optimism and prosperity and hopefulness and uh, you know and that's what jade represents. Like the royalty would wear it in in Asian cultures. It wasn't like oh everybody's got their own piece of jade that no that's not the way it was it's a, such a special thing i mean we've had our we've had specialty shows here at hsn over the years that were just jade and i can't remember the last time we've had that because it's just so rare and so difficult to get so the item number is 691-311 jay and i have another hour of beautiful pieces together that we're going to be presenting to you uh lots of amazing amazing pieces that you know honestly it's just such a really unique show, a show filled with pieces that 
you know, you're really not going to see anywhere else. And, you know, I talk about traveling. One of my favorite things to do is to go on a cruise. And I know the cruise lines are just sort of like now kind of coming back to life. And one of the things you see on those cruise ships are in the high-end jewelry stores and the really fancy cruise lines is Larimar. Because it looks, you know, it's it looks, you know, some people might confuse it with aquamarine or even turquoise and things like that, but it's its very own stone. And it's, ve this is very limited. It's Larimar and black spinel. I have only 50 pairs of the earrings that go back with it and 300 necklaces, and that is it. So when I saw the price on this, I mean, I don't think I've ever seen it for less than $500. Like, not even, like, a Larmar necklace would be, like, a chain with one piece of Larmar on it. I mean, this is really uh, extraordinary. And also, people recognize this stone. It has kind of, like, it looks like a perfect blue sky with, like, a little white fluffy cloud going by. That's, that's what Larimar looks like to me. So I'm excited that you're able to get this very very limited piece so I wanted to give you a little peek at the beginning of the show and so you're able to get that but now we're going to talk about and this is going to be quick I'm telling you right now I have 169 necklaces every review is perfect five stars by the way and then I've got earrings to go back with it and these are like kind of big bold with a dangle on them I love it and I think I only have about 176 uh, earrings so this is not a lot let me turn that to you so you can see the chatoyancy of this blonde cat's eye beautiful jewelry. And blonde cat's eye, this is real blonde cat's eye. Let me just start with that. This isn't glass beads or plastic. And I know a lot of like, you know, faux and costume jewelry try to recreate this. But that chatoyancy that looks kind of like the, uh, you know, like the eye is following you. Like, is that cat, is that cat looking at me? That's what chatoyancy is. And that's what you're getting in this beautiful piece. There's gorgeous Angie. She's going to be continuing on as our model for the second hour. But Jay, uh, we don't have a lot of these, so I know this is going to be quick. Yeah, that's a material so rare, okay? And <clears throat> it does have the property of chatoyancy, and cat's eye is the, the correct name for it. I mean, it, uh, if, you've ever, um, if you've ever been out at night, okay? Um, I was sitting, I was sitting uh, uh, one night, I was sitting out in our pool deck, and we live in a kind of a rural area, and... Um, all the lights were down low and I had the lights in the house and everything. And I looked out um, and around our lanai and all of a sudden I see all these eyes looking <laughs> at me. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> no bueno. What it is, it's not, <laughs> no, no, it's not just cats. Uh, I'm not sure, I don't know if we had a raccoon family or it's possums. I don't know who it was. It might've been cats. I don't know. We do have some feral cats in the area but you could see their eyes glowing at night. It was, it was kind of cool, but it was kind of spooky in a way too, you know? But uh, every time I see this material, I always think about that, that night. I always think about how crazy that is. If you've ever been out and you see, um, you know, the, the refraction of, their, of the lights, because they're nocturnal animals, uh, that when you see that, that's what is glowing. And this has that same effect. And what causes it, is it's actually a crystal, if you got a, a loop or if you got a magnifying glass and you looked really close at this material, you would see tiny crystals. See that where that's shiny and everything in there? You could actually see little striations in line. But if you looked at it and you magnify it, you would see that there's actually tiny, tiny crystals growing long ways, right? They're, they're long crystals, they're, they're not little little short specks, they're actually long crystals, and that's what's giving it that, that wet look, that property of a, a chatoyancy, where it looks like it's glowing in the dark, and really that is kind of what it does. That's, that's actually the kind of look, that's what, that's what ever, attracts everybody to it. And on this on Ange, look at the size of this. Okay, this is like over the top, as far as big, bold, massive. And you want that because the bigger the material, the more the, sh uh, the chatoyant 
uh, properties show up in the material. It's 20 and a quarter inches in length of the necklace and with a two and three quarter inch extender. So it can be 20 inches, 21 inches, 22 inches, almost 23 inches. So you can sort of adjust that. But the size of the beads are also very large millimeter. They're 18, um, eight millimeter to 18 millimeter. So uh, they're graduated with the largest big, I mean, 18 millimeter beads, that's quite large. So that's what you're seeing. That's what you're getting. Uh, continue shopping. Oh, we've got so many more goodies. This is very limited. I, I knew it was going to be really short because it's a, we'll keep you updated and let you know when it goes. Now, still to come in this hour, we've got lots more. Okay, I have a Tyrone turquoise bead necklace coming up. $79.68. That is a fabulous price. I love it when we have these amazing prices on these beautiful pieces. So check that out. You can start pre-ordering 769-900 is the item number if you would like to start ordering on that gorgeous necklace. So it, we'll, we'll see that in just like a couple, just like a couple seconds. But the, our next piece is a uh, multicolor unikite necklace. It is big. It is bold. I know I don't even have to ask. I know this is one of Jay's designs. And the earrings also have like more of a bolder design to it. They're not heavy, by the way. They're also, they're lightweight, but they have a bead and then they have the kind of like this obelisk underneath. Look at that. And you see the pink and the green. Look how beautiful that is. Is that not incredible? You see how it's faceted and it kind of twinkles? Gorgeous. The earrings are on sale for $76.09, and the necklace is $166.09. You know, my favorite color combination for home decor, for fashion, everything, I love pink and green together. And I don't think I've ever seen a necklace that really showcases that as well as this one does, Jay. This is, uh, I, you know, um, to, be, to be honest with you, I was kind of surprised. I didn't know that this was going to be on this hour. Um, this is a very special, unique material. This Unikite, I have bought it in um, several locations in the world. I've, I've gotten Unikite in Africa. I've bought it in South Africa. Uh, I mean, uh, South America, in Africa. This material, though, is some of the highest grade I've ever, ever had the pleasure of working with. And it's so hard that you could facet it. Look at the facet this takes. And this comes out of uh, Northwestern Australia is where I got the rough from. Unikite is so special, it's so spectacular. These are really truly one of a kind designs and Helen pegged it, she knows this has the J. King hand all over it. <laughs> I didn't even design. ask you, tell, tell okay. the truth. I just, I didn't even have to ask. <laughs> it's, uh, you know, when I design it's like, it's, you know, I like, I have my own thing. I mean, that's why, you know, there's, we have different designers, we're family. We design everything in house but we all have our own little feel. I, I love to showcase the stone. And I love big, I love bold, and this is something that really, I mean, you, you just you, you just fall in love with it. I mean, this is a material that is fairly rare. You don't see it in this quality in Unikite. I don't want you, everybody to think that this is just run of the mill Unikite and you just run down the road and this is what you get. Mm -hmm. That's not the case. This is really, really super high grade, very, very special. Um, again, the nature of the beast on this though, is the fact that every necklace, the one that Ange is wearing, and the one that you have on right now, if you compared them side by side, even though they're the same design, mm -hmm. the same basic design, right. they're gonna look different. They're, they're totally one of a kind designs because yeah, it's natural material. Each stone is different, yeah. They're all different, and they're going to be different on Angie's too. And what's great, like, now you're wearing this kind of longer. You could actually bring it up if you wanted. Um, you can bring it up higher. You can bring it down lower. You get two and three quarters of an inch uh, in our, our, um, on our signature uh, sterling silver mm -hmm. extender chain. And we do that just for that reason, so that you can... You can either wear it a little bit higher, you can wear it medium, you can wear it lower. It's not like you're just stuck with one size. 
Yeah, this one is 20 inches in the length. Actually, it's a little bit longer than most of them. And you're right, I could wear it like up here, like this kind of like a little bit of like more of a choker length. That looks really cool too. It feels so amazing on your skin. Genuine uh, gemstones and stones are cold. If it was plastic or glass or something created like that, it doesn't it doesn't have that cold to the touch feel. I, I could probably just feel a, a stone and tell you if it's a genuine gemstone or if it's it's not. Just basically from the temperature. That, that's a little that's a little key for those of you out there that are shopping for jewelry. That's that's something that you know. But these these colors are spectacular. Jay's right. You know there is there is unikite. It's like okay, it's what is that? Where is that? This is not just run in the mill. It's because of the color and the brightness of the greens and the brightness of the pinks and the way they way they went together in this in the rough. And also because it's not like a plastic bead where every single one is the same, each single bead, each single giant, um, you know, kind of that those rectangles more that are faceted have their own beautiful artwork on them from Mother Nature, creating that combination of pink and green. One's a little more pink, the other one's a little more green and everything in between. So loving that. The other number is 092680. Here are the earrings that go back. They're 7609. Don't forget five flex pan everything. So this flex pan earrings are just $15.22 to get home. If you're just tuning in and you missed our last hour, uh, we had gorgeous Charite jewelry that was very popular that I want to give you another peek at. We have in the Charite jewelry, there's also a ring and earring that go back with that. So a lot of you are big fans of that. So I wanted to make sure you had the opportunity to pick that up. So Charite jewelry, $169.55 for the necklace. And then we also had a ring and we had, do we just, I think we just had a, a ring with the charite as well, um, earring, earring, excuse me. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about Tyrone Turquoise. At $79.68, I can put this on in two seconds, look at that. All of a sudden, <laughs> you've got turquoise. And you think about a turquoise necklace, how much would you, you know, I know a lot of people want to collect it from all the mines that there are, you know, like different types. This is $79.68, and I know that this, Jay, is from your private collection, this particular piece. Yeah. So I, I'll let you talk ab ab about this, because these are kind of reminds me of their, when I was growing up, Jay, we used to wear a necklace called a puka necklace. This puka shell thing was very popular, I think, in the 70s. That's what, that, it looks kind of like those kind of, sl those little kind of disc beads like that. Yeah, I, actually, you might have bought one of my puka necklaces when you, <laughs> when you were growing up. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> <laughs> Although I am a, a slightly older than you are, um, but uh, yeah, uh, you know, I, I have, uh, I have made more than one puka necklace in my lifetime. Um, so here's the deal with this, okay? If you're a turquoise collector, if you're not even, um, this is Tyrone turquoise. This is uh, very close to my heart. Um, this comes from uh, out of Silver City, New Mexico. So my, my alma mater, we're still based out of Albuquerque, New Mexico. I grew up in New Mexico. Uh, I moved to New Mexico in the 1956. I've always uh, considered it, uh, you know, the heartland, my home, uh, even though I've had homes all over, I mean, and even all over the world, um, uh, you know, I've always considered uh, New Mexico my heritage, you know, my, my primary. I moved there when I was six months old. Um, this is the one and only turquoise that I've ever got out of, uh, out of New Mexico, even though New Mexico did at one time had several, several uh, turquoise mines. Um, this, they, they still, it's still active as far as um, they, it's not a full-time mine, but they, it, they, there is still turquoise there, and they do uh, now and then get it. Um, this is the one and only time I've really done a necklace. Look at this. This is all the natural color of this. This is a stupid, stupid price. Even my original price that I gave them was a stupid price. They've taken that and even made it even crazier, okay? And I did this because I had all of these nuggets left. Uh, I didn't really, they weren't big enough that I could cut big cabochons or anything. But look at the color in this, and here again, this is not enhanced. 
It has such a unique texture to it. It has such a unique feel to it. And it is an American turquoise. So if you collect turquoises, it's one of the, the rare materials that, that is available in turquoise today. And the American turquoises, to tell you the truth, are not going down in value. They're only going up. Oh, They're yeah. one of the more sought after. Even a lot of like the old Landers, the old number eight, um, Hidden Valley, all of the old turquoises, Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty, um, a lot of the Sleeping Beauty rough, believe it or not, uh, weight for weight, so gram for gram. Some of the Sleeping Beauty, honestly, the, the really big material that's clear, clear, is actually more expensive than gold, gram to gram. Mm, I, so a I, lot of these surprised. American turquoises, no, a lot of these American turquoises have become extremely uh, highly collectible. And you, you have people that are actually buying these as commodities now. And that, that's what sent Sleeping Beauty through the roof. People, they're not buying it to cut and make jewelry, make jewelry. out of it. Yeah, they're, they're buying, buying it, it like for to... the rarity of it. Right. And they're buying it as a commodity and they're buying the super high grades and they're putting it back just like you would buy wheat mm -hmm. or, or barrels of oil <laughs> right. or Pork sugar bellies. or whatever. <laughs> whatever. As, they're buying it as yeah, a commodity commodities. Yeah, to store it. Yeah, and, and it does. It drives the, the global price up so that when you, you know, everybody, it trickles down to us. But the fact that this necklace is $79.68, if you tried to, again, just go somewhere and say, I'd like to buy the material to make this necklace, I don't know if you could even source it for seventy nine sixty eight J. Well, you know, and this, this material, just so you know, is rare, okay? Even though that they're still, you know, trickling it out every now and then, you know, they go in, they mine, it, it's still available. It's not available in any kind of quality, it, uh, quantity. Um, it's uh, usually a very nice quality that they do get because they're very selective, but it's not like there's huge amounts of it. I mean, you know, every now and then, you know, you'll see a few kilos of it, you know, or or maybe like 100 pounds or something will come out. It's not something that, that's operational, like full time, uh, full on. Um, uh, I will tell you this with Tyrone though, this is a very unique, a very different turquoise. Um, uh, it's very dear to my heart because it is mined uh, in New Mexico. Uh, the, the mine is, is just, just below uh, Silver City, New Mexico. So it's, it's down almost, if you, if you ever look at a map, of the United States, and you'll see New Mexico it has what they call the boot heel, which is the lower lower half. There's it, it looks like it's got a boot heel on it. Silver City is down in that re region right there, and that's where um, that's where this uh, deposit is, and that's where the mine is. Look at these. These are okay. These aren't chips. And that's what I want to point out. This isn't scrap. This isn't where I took scrap and said, okay, I'm, I'm going to use up all my scrap and put it into a necklace. These were all the little thin nugget flats I had left. Um, and, you know, I, I, I've had these for years and years. I decided, you know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and make something simple. Uh, this kind of takes me back to the day when I was making puka shell necklaces and turquoise <laughs> necklaces like this. <clears throat> My hair was substantially longer and a lot darker <laughs> at that time. Um, and, uh, but it brings back a lot of memories. Something very simple. Uh, something you can wear, but you know, here again, highly collectible and probably a screaming, screaming value. I mean, um, just the material alone is worth more than than what we're selling the whole design for. Well, everybody gets it, Jay. We're busier on the phones on, on this item than in the whole show. People are saying, wait a minute, is that genuine Tyrone turquoise at 79.68? And yes, I, I need to have it. So I'm excited for those of you who are adding this to your collection. It's a really pretty necklace. It feels fabulous on. You wear it all the time. I mean, it looks great in the summer with a white t-shirt. Um, it's going to look great in, in the fall with a green sweater. I mean, you're going to just wear it. The nice thing about jewelry is it's seasonless. It's timeless you know it's it's not something that's ever going to go out of style and the value of turquoise as we've seen in the market it's just i remember a couple of years ago jay you and i were talking about how other markets in the world it has always been very popular in america but when other parts of the world asia and europe just start, started like 
go, just like being like, okay, turquoise, gotta have it, gotta have it. And then the prices like just went up globally. The fact that we're still able to do this because you've got this in the back of your warehouse from 1972 or wherever, <laughs> that's how that's how we get these prices. Seven six well, you know, nine you know, nine hundred is the item number. Yes, Jay. Even in turquoise, like what you're saying is so crazy. Is I see, you know, like um, you know, on the traveling the world. We're starting to see turquoise worldwide. I mean, so it's really crazy. <clears throat> I love this. This has an amazing story to it. Okay, phosphosiderite and lavender opal. I only have 145 of them. This is gonna be very, very quick. I wanna put it on so you can see it on. But if you love, again, that beautiful purple color, look at that. Is that not, this is big, this is bold. I know, like I said, it's very limited. We, we don't have a lot of time because we don't have a lot of these. 20 inches with a two and three quarter inch extender. And this is from the beautiful purple phosphosiderite is from Chile, right, Jay? So this is Chilean phosphosiderite. Uh, unlike any ph phosphosiderite anywhere else in the world, the highest grade, the highest quality, and <clears throat> paired back to the last of the last of the last of this beautiful lavender Jalisco opal. That's a natural opal. So those those side beads, that is Jalisco lavender opal. This is the one and only time I couldn't repeat this if I wanted to. Uh, I don't, I've got Foster Siderite, I have zero Jalisco lavender opal, and there is zero left at the mine. There is nothing. This is the last of the last of the material. Uh, we did, the, this was the final design that we did and that we will ever be able to do combining these two materials. Oh, it's so pretty. And it's very bold as well. Uh, I'm guessing, Jay, this is one of your designs. Yeah, I did it um, <laughs> because- Sounds like you're confessing. Um, well, never, <laughs> I did it. <laughs> number one, I just, you know, like, okay. And then I'm very selective on, and I do, I just thought for these, two colors, these two rough materials naturally combine together so wonderfully. Now, I'm just telling you right now, if you want this, this is it. it you'll never see this again. I, I have no, I, I, when I say no Jalisco Lavender Opal, I have a specimen in my specimen keep. I, I always keep one specimen of every rough material I've ever used in my entire life. Um, it's, it's, um, it's actually kind of chronic at this stage. I might have to build another building to, <laughs> uh -oh. to do specimen displays. Uh, one of these days I'm threatening to actually, um, you know, take pictures and actually, you know, um, uh, write about them. You know, write, you know, where we By the way, FYI, from, this is gonna got. sell out. This is 100% gonna sell well, out. We have 82 is, left, okay, I'm 81 just telling you right left, now, 79 this, left. <laughs> this is your only chance ever to get this. Okay. Um, Thank you'll, you you'll so never, much. You'll never see Don't it ever hang again. up. You're part of the uh, wait list. Uh, or you're part of the order. So if you're on the line, we're counting you as part of our sellout. So thank you so much for your calls and orders for our phosphorciderite necklace. We're going to continue on. We've got more goodies to show you. Take a look at this. Sterling silver and appetite bead necklace. 32 inches long also available are the earrings. And I think the earrings on this are really, really pretty. Let me scooch over here and show you. The, the, these are so pretty. I love the design. You've got the French wire. I know I have to take this off because we've sold it out. Um, and then this is a very long, long necklace. And you know what? I'm gonna show you that long necklace, you can just throw it over your head and wear it really long. But what I'm gonna do, I think, is I'm gonna double it over. So let's see if I can do this upside down and backwards. Maybe, maybe yes, maybe no. I might need a, a mirror to be able to do this because it's, oh no, I got it. I think it, I can double this and then wear it like this. Sorry. <laughs> Just popping this on to look at, look at how cool that is. Let me move the finding around. So appetite, and I also really like the earrings. I think that they have like a beautiful kind of movement to them and they're really fun and festive. They're perfect for this, you know, light summer. But appetite jewelry, again, if you're a jewelry person and you know about gemstones and you know how rare appetite is, I, you know, honestly, Jay, we don't do a lot of appetite. This is a very different kind of a stone for you. I don't really see this a lot. Okay, you know what makes this so unique and, and so different is this. Okay, like uh, this comes from Brazil. Uh, when I bought this material, I was 
you know, I wasn't going to Brazil to source appetite. Um, we were doing a project. In fact, we were uh, we were doing the Emerald uh, was one of the projects that we were doing on that run. And um, so this is a byproduct of traveling. And that's why I've got to get back out there. And we've got to, you know, that to, to source these new materials, to find these new materials. If you look at this, and Ange is showing it beautifully here, because I got to tell you, stage lighting is not my friend. It is not my <laughs> friend. Uh, but this is showing it beautifully because of what Ange is, uh, uh, the background she's wearing on. It's a, it's before it kind of almost looked green. This is a really nice, it's almost like a Swiss blue topaz color. It's, it's not a neon appetite, but it's almost there. It's very, very close to neon appetite. What makes this so unique and so different, and it's not only the material, it's designing with the material, it's designing with what Mother Nature gave you. And in this case, um, the challenge was, these came in little small crystals. You can see these are little crystal nuggets. All I've done, all I've done is I've taken the natural appetite crystals these were all little crystals. And all I did is we just polished them and you know, uh, took them and polished each nugget so that we took off all the sharp edges. And then we uh, diamond drilled them with a, a, a diamond dremel and then we strung them. So you, know, you have to take what she's, Mother Nature's provided with you and then do the best uh, design that you can do with that. Give, you, give, you know, give everybody the biggest bang for the buck. But this is a very rare, appetite material, um, so rare that, I mean, I obtained it that one time. There wasn't a lot of it. Uh, we used up everything uh, just doing this project. We couldn't even do the amount that they ordered. We, we, we were able to do about half of what they actually wanted. We just didn't have enough material in the end to, to be able to make it stretch. So a beautiful, genuine appetite. It's, it's more like a topazy blue, like a Swiss blue. Um, it's, it, when it comes off on the air, sometimes it's being a little bit more greeny. When you get it home and you open that box though, you're gonna see that it is more, it's more like a, almost like a, 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 a blue topazy type feel to it is what it, is what it really looks like. It's, here it's looking a little darker, a little bit more green. Mm -hmm. There it's looking kind of more, what you'll see, it's like a, kind of a bluey, more of a blue, like a topaz, mm -hmm. light, light topaz blue. Yeah, it's got kind of like a, like a, almost like a aquamarine color to it. It's really very fresh and beautiful, but you're right, get, get this home. And these earrings, it's a very lightweight stone. So this is, even though it's a big, bold earring, it's not gonna weigh down your ears at all. And the earrings are only $67.27. The necklace is, I mean, it is 32 inches. So I doubled it over. And Angie was wearing it long, but uh, I'm just sh I'm just showing you. You could you could double it over. You could even put like a pendant here. I just think it looks really gorgeous. It's really a good summer stone too. So the item number zero nine six six eight seven. If you would like to get it home, we do have more goodies coming up in the show. I would like to show you a little peek at the today special. The today special is the big three emeralds rubies, sapphire, exclusively available for us here at HSN. Here's Angie from earlier wearing the Today Special necklace. There is a pendant that's also available. She's wearing the also available pendant. But how rare is it to get genuine rubies, genuine blue rich sapphires, and genuine emeralds in a graduated faceted necklace? You've got 18 inches with a two and three quarter inch extender on this, and this is one day, one day only. The emerald is 144.88, all available on five flex pay. Uh, the sapphire 144.88, and the ruby is 186.26. And you know, it's funny. Jay was just talking about that. Um, you know, the 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 TV set is not the friend of jewelry. Uh, it's you got to get this one home and see how incredible it is. So we're gonna t we're going to take a teeny little break, and when we come back. We've got more beautiful pieces, including spiny oyster, which we're gonna be showcasing next after this quick message. So we'll see you back in a second. With the power of HP from HSN, reinvent how you work, how you play, how you live. Technology that makes life better for everyone, everywhere, and deals designed for every budget. HP on HSN and at hsn.com. 
worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smart and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. Well, thank you so much for watching HSN. My name is Helen Keeney. Uh, we have just about 25 minutes left of our two hour show with Jay King. And we're now gonna talk about color. Pops of beautiful color. And this is the spiny oyster shell pendant with the necklace. So here's the pendant. Here's the necklace. The pendant is two inches long. The necklace is 18 inches with a two and three quarter inch extender. There is also a ring available, a cuff available. I'm wearing the earrings that are also available. Feature price. So the necklace is, there's the beautiful earrings. Just kind of bringing the whole look together. So $221.50 is how much the necklace is. Today, we are doing a feature price of just $199.36. We're giving you five months to pay it off and that's any major credit card, so $39.87. Angie, beautiful Angie's wearing it as well. Jay, we're talking about spiny oyster and we were talking about coral and when you talk about things like this, it's, you know, we're, we're talking about things that are difficult, difficult to source and especially how beautiful the color is on this. It's really just that beautiful magical color. This is like amber, it's like pearls. Um, yeah. Like mother of pearl. It's called, they call them organ organic gem material, right? Is yeah. kind of, you know, what it, you know, it's known for in the trade. But this has a lot of memories for me. Uh, anytime I work with spiny, uh, I get flashbacks. <laughs> <clears throat> you know, I, I have a huge history of this. I, this even goes back to my pre-jewelry days. When I first started out, um, you know, uh, we used to, I went to college in Southern New Mexico. And so uh, a, a group of us, we were all divers. And so uh, we had a friend that had this old Volkswagen van and um, we would all throw our tanks in there, um, cram, you know, cram all into that Volkswagen van and we would drive down to uh, San Carlos, um, you know, our Wymus. Uh, and we, back then, you could literally camp on the beach. You know, we would pull up, you know, get a bonfire going, camp on the beach. We, um, you know, we dove um, for our food. And so we, you know, we would spearfish, um, we would gather things. And one of the, the things, the first time I was ever introduced to, to Spiny Oyster was there would be stacks of the oyster shell on the beach. And at that time, now I'm talking early 70s, early, early 70s, right? Um, and what it was, the locals had harvested the meat of the oyster, that's what they wanted. The shell was no good to them at all. So it was people like us, we used to get gunny sacks and load this. If you did it today, you would be arrested. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I would, be in a, I would be in jail either at the US border or in a Mexican jail. I would, I would be in a jail, right? You couldn't do it. But back then, it was no big deal. I mean, there was you didn't need a, a fish and wildlife permit or anything. And we used to pack that Volkswagen van, I mean, uh, full of bags of spiny oyster shell. And then we get back up, um, you know, we would make jewelry out of it. We would, um, we would cut it into beads. And now, this is protected, right? It only comes out of the Sea of Cortez in Mexico, which is the Baja region. There's only about 12 families, they're all grandfathered in that can still harvest this. There's only two seasons a year. They have two short, two-week seasons when they're actually allowed to harvest the oyster shell. This material, this material now is very expensive. It's very hard to come by. Um, it's, like I said, there's only a dozen families that are still grandfathered in that they actually give permits um, to, to actually harvest it. And it is protected. It, they will, yeah, you get caught with it and you're out of season 
and you're um, and you're harvesting it and you and and you're out of season and you're not uh, don't have a permit to harvest it, you're in serious serious trouble. So this is something that's really unique, very different. This is the orange version. It's got a little red in it, but it comes in purple, which is very limited, about 5% is purple. Uh, orange, which is the most predominant, and red, which is the second rarest. Orange and red are the two predominant colors. And then if you can get this in purple, purple is like less than 5% of its purple. This is that beautiful, like, it looks like a gorgeous sunset, kind of fiery or orange. So here's the item number for the necklace with the pendant. Seven, six, nine, four, six, two. But also, but also available, I have the bracelet cuff, the ring, and then I'm also wearing the earrings that are available. There's a hundred left in the cuff, so that's all we have. The ring, I have sizes five through twelve, and uh, you know the earrings are also available. They're pierced with a butterfly clutch back. Let me show you the back. So these are really beautiful, and they are on five flex <coughs> by J. You know, I love these, and I did this whole ensemble, I did this whole suite, and this is why, okay? This material, I don't know what you're gonna match it back to, right? So, um, you know, in this case, uh, I was able to go ahead, I just did a whole suite, a whole set. Uh, I just designed all this, I like to keep it simple, I like to keep it contemporary. Uh, I will tell you right now, uh, this cuff bracelet right here, is something, I have something very similar in Spiny Oyster um, that I've done for myself. Um, I wear it constantly. I love this material. Um, like I said, it, it's got a big history for me. But, um, you know, this is something, and I'm not saying, you know, don't don't break the bake, don't stretch it. I mean, but if you want the whole set, it is available. Uh, and But the reason I do that in a lot of these materials is there's no way you're ever gonna get anything that matches back to that. Yeah, you're right. You're not going to get that exact color. You're not going to get those, you know, those pieces. So keep shopping. We've got more to come. We've got about 20 minutes left, and I want to make sure I get to everything in the show. So Tiger's Eye Bead Jewelry. Bold, beautiful, 32 inches, and then we also have earrings. These earrings are only $35.13. The necklace is on an um, uh, amazing clearance price of $95.30. We just reduced this, and don't forget, we also were doing the flex pay. So, five flex pay. So, even though it's um, you know like $35.30 for the earrings, you're getting them home for what is that? $19.05 is the, that's for the necklace, is that's the flex pay is $19.05. The earrings of flex pay is just $7.03. So $7.03 to get home these beautiful earrings with a French wire. And this is the tiger's eye. And we had blonde tiger's eye before. This is the richer, deeper tiger's eye. And you see the necklace one 142 to 95.30. Earrings from 52.25 to 35.13. So th this is gonna go quick. We've had several sellouts in the show. If you want this because of the amazing, you know, obviously it's a great deal, I would order right away. I would order quickly. Jay, these, these are beautiful pieces. But you know what's so crazy about this and is, um, you know, we are the manufacturers. <clears throat> I don't just say that, it's no brag, it's fact, right? <laughs> I mean, you know, that's, that's, that's actually what made the MindFind um, uh, show be able to happen. We're a very niche business. We have some very, very loyal fans who have uh, shopped with us over the years and uh, who actually collect us. And we always welcome uh, uh, new people uh, and, uh, to our designs and what we do. And <clears throat> for people that don't understand what we do, is we go right to the source, right to the mine. We're, we're working directly from the rough materials. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, we're basically uh, manufacturers, so we're really bringing it to you mine direct. I mean, there are no middlemen, and that's why we can offer the prices that we offer. And what makes this such a crazy value is this. If you think about this, our original price, that's, <coughs> excuse me, almost a wholesale price right there. So just our original price, they yeah. are, um, what they're, they're doing this, they've given you a clearance price on this. And when they do clearances, if you read the reviews, it's not because people didn't like it. It's just that um, we don't bring things back. And in this case, we wouldn't bring it, uh, uh, the design back. 
And so uh, we're, we're not gonna do reorders. That's our, that's really kind of our, what we do also. You can always be assured when you tune in for the Mind Find show, you're gonna see new, you're gonna see different. We don't do the same old, same old, same old all the time. We're always doing something new. We're always challenging ourselves. New rough materials, new mm -hmm. designs, new looks. In this case, even look at the beads, right? They're gorgeous. Do you see how creative these beads are? Mm -hmm. Not only the size of this, but look at the creativity in cutting the beads. These are all free form beads. These are all free shape. They're all done from the natural rough. They're all done by, uh, uh, by hand. This is that uh, natural tiger's eye. This, uh, I get my material. This material comes out of my original source that I've had since the 70s. This all comes out of Namibia is where they get this. And this is the golden tiger's eye. There's basically four colors. There's the golden, um, then you have the red, then you have the blue, and then about 10 years ago, maybe a little bit longer now, um, uh, they came up, they are started finding the blonde material. So you've got gold, red, blue, blonde in this material. What is so amazing about Tiger's Eye, it has that per top, uh, property that we were just showing you there, we were demonstrating of its chatoyant. It gleams, it glows. Um, and that's because of the natural crystals that crystals that are growing through the host rock in this material. That's why it polishes so amazing. But even after you polish it, then when you're seeing it glow and sparkle, uh, in some cases we fasted it but, uh, for the bling, but you can just see even the beads that aren't faceted, do you see how they're sparkling? They're gleaming. They have mm -hmm. that kind of glow to them. Yeah, that I'm showing the chatoyancy right here because you really can yeah, see it. It looks literally chitoyancy. like a tiger's eye. If I had it this way, <laughs> it's like a tiger's eye. I mean, and everybody's going to get a different, a different, ne you know, necklace really because it's from the earth. These are beautiful faceted beads. By the way, 32 inches. It's very long, substantial necklace, and it's very, very busy on the phone. Very popular. It's a kind of a classic jewel gemstone piece that's on a clearance price. And Rick, do we have a lot of these? I'm not, I wasn't really sure of how many we had available. Yeah, we, we have about, okay, we have a few hundred of each. So, you know, if you wanna jump in now, you'll be able to get the last quantity of it. So five flex pay with any major credit card. And then with the HSN card, you get an extra flex payment. The necklace is only $15.88 to get home. If you don't have an HSN card, we're actually doing the biggest promotion that we ever do, which is $40 coupon when you open and use an HSN, the, your brand new HSN card. No annual fee, by the way, to have the HSN card. You go to hsn.com, put an HSN card in the search, or call that 800 number, which is 694-1418. And, you know, get grab this necklace for $55.30 with that $40 coupon that you get. It really is something that you will go to in your wardrobe time and time and time again. It is a great neutral when you're dressing and styling, uh, but it's also genuine gemstones. And when you touch them, they've got the coldness and they feel like genuine gemstones. It's not like plastic or glass, you know, this is kind of very difficult to recreate in a, you know, kind of plastic or glass because because of that chatoyancy, you can't really recreate that. So keep shopping. We got more goodies to show you. We've only got a couple more things left. We only got about 15 minutes left in our two hour show. So we're gonna, we're gonna continue on with our next piece. Oh, this is the Laramar pieces. So very popular from our uh, you know, a little sneak peek at the top of the show. The necklace, okay, wow, all right. There's only 20 pairs of earrings left and 300 necklaces. I'm wearing the earrings and I'm wearing the necklace, 20. So if you wanna get a good look at the earrings, <laughs> they are, they're beautiful and they're, you know, Laramar has, it's like looking at a beautiful clear blue sky and then a white fluffy cloud kind of comes by and that's what you see with Laramar. There's the earrings, look how beautiful they are. They're, they've got like some movement in them, butterfly clutch back. Like I said, there's 20, so this is gonna be quick. And then the black spinel is interspersed with the beautiful pieces of Laramar in this necklace, Jay. I love that idea of doing the black spinel and Laramar together. How did that come about? the opposite. Well, I did the offset colors in there. I just thought it was really cool. Also, the yeah. in the nuggets, the natural nuggets, they actually, um, the act is uh, pivot beads, right? So they're not rubbing against you. Ah. So when you put it on, it lays so much nicer, right? 
See, there is a method to my madness, <laughs> right? Well, uh, you know, I, if so you had said, getting, the, pick, pick a gemstone right. to go with Larimar, I don't know if, if black spinel would pop in my head like immediately, but it looks really like, rich. And look, when you see in between the stones, the black, right. it has sparkle to it, but it, then it kind of like goes in the background and sets off the Larimar. It's really gorgeous. Do you know, it's funny you said that because originally when I designed this, I did um, lapis beads. So I did blue going back yeah. with the Larimar. Yeah. <clears throat> And, but the problem was the lapis wasn't hard enough. And um, you can't, you know, I, uh, when I fastened it, it was nice and everything, but it wasn't hard enough. And we were having a lot of uh, breakage and everything. So we, we tested. So the black spinel, extremely, uh, extremely, extremely hard and facets beautifully. So those are actually even faceted black spinel beads as pivot beads in between there. They actually facet that, they hold it with a pair of tweezers as they facet it. It's pretty, pretty uh, unique. But... Lara Mark, okay, you've been on cruises. I know you have, okay? Um, you know, if you see this, if you go down, I, I travel the Caribbean, I've been, I've been all over uh, down. There's not a, an island probably that I, that I haven't been to uh, sometime in my life. And Lara Mark, um, I have an update, uh, Jay. The, the earrings sadly sold out. So I, I just wanted to okay. give everybody a heads up. We do have the necklace still. So the necklace is still okay. available. Go ahead, Jay. Well, you know, number one, Helen, when you see this, you don't see Larimar necklaces, do you? You see, usually they'll have a ring, right? Or they'll have a pair of earrings, or they'll have a pendant, or they'll have a cup bracelet. Uh, they're not gonna have like but a necklace like this. No way. They're not gonna have a necklace. Very rarely do they have beads in Larimar. They, they, now and then they will, but very, very uh, often they do it. If you see the prices, it's usually set in gold. It's usually very, very high end. This all comes out of one location in the world. It comes out of the Dominican Republic. I have been, I have been to this mine personally, actually to the mine site four times in my life. Okay, I have never walked away with any rough, not a single time. I've never been able to do a deal. I, 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 I'm just being honest with you. I have never been able to put a deal together at the mine. It's one of the few times that where um, they always charge me some crazy price, you know, that where you can't really work it. How I'm getting this material, and I don't want to get anybody in trouble, but uh, one of the one of the relatives what, that's related to to one of the major players at the mine is who I buy the rough from, and so he gets family rate, I guess, or whatever. <laughs> I'm able to. So me going direct, I can't get the price I need, but going uh, this is this is a, a one of those rarities where I go through somebody else to be able to get the price I need to be able to sell the material. So this material is very rare. It's very hard to get, guys. And even when you get it, like I said, I've been four times to the mine in my lifetime. I've never been able to do a deal. This material is very hard to get, very expensive. It's got a very unique look to it. This, it, When you have Larimar, anybody who's ever knows Larimar or has ever seen it, they will point it out to you <laughs> right away. That's that so it is Larimar, they know. And almost anybody who's ever been on a cruise, who's ever been in, in the Caribbean, who's ever done any uh, any uh, of the islands uh, in where uh, primarily is where you see um, in the uh, Medit uh, the uh, Caribbean is where you uh, normally see this, or in the Bahamas, um, that they they know the value of it, they know how expensive it is, and they know how rare it is. Yeah, and by the way, the earrings are on wait list, so those just went. Um, we do have a few, how many necklaces are left? About 200 necklaces left. So we're gonna continue on. We've got one more piece in the show. All right. Let's 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 jump into the Sonoran Opal and Turquoise Bead Necklace. I'm going to take this out and I'm going to pop in our last item in the show. I do have earrings that go back and as you know that they do sell out quickly. So the earrings are available for 39.42 and the necklace is 86.96. So you've got beautiful Sonoran Opal and then you've got Seven Peaks Turquoise in this. 10 by 11 millimeter to five by seven millimeter in this graduated piece. But look how look at how the turquoise like really pops against that. It's really gorgeous. I'll, I'll put this on so you can see, see this necklace on. So, so pretty. But Jay, you know, 
we we've had like an incredible two hour show and everything is like very you know exciting and unique and great prices i don't i don't think i've ever seen anything like this where you talk about what do you have for sonoran yellow opals you know if you ask somebody that i i love that when you have something like this that nobody else has i mean it's not it's not something you're going to see in a store you're not really going to see it anywhere else and it's such pretty colors jay you're not even going to see it for me ever. <laughs> so, oh, okay. There the you thing. go. Now, this is, okay, this is it. Okay, as far as this, this is, it almost looks like a butterscotch amber. Yes, is, is it, what, yes. You know, is, it, it has that feel to it, that color. Mm -hmm. This is a very rare. Now, yellow opal, just in general, okay, in, in 46 years of doing this professionally, I've had yellow opal four times um, from four different uh, countries and from three different continents. Um, <clears throat> this is Sonoran. It comes from Mexico, Sonora, Mexico. I bought this yellow opal out of somebody's private collection, the original miner. This was mined 20 years ago, uh, even longer than 20 years ago, uh, probably around 22 years ago that th th this was mined. I knew he had it. I knew where he had it. Um, and about two years ago, three years ago, Right at three years ago, because it was, yeah, because last year we, we, yeah, we did, the year, this year we didn't have Tucson, last year we uh, did, so it was the year before that. So it's been three years since I bought this material. I, I knew he had it stashed, he had it stashed in a warehouse in Tucson. Uh, I was able to talk him into selling this at a reasonable price. This is a natural yellow opal. He had the one and only deposit. He, it, he mined this out. This this is something he had kept back, um, and we, I knew he had it. He tried to sell it for years and years. He had a really crazy price on it, um, and we were able to finally come to what I considered a reasonable price for it. It's a natural yellow opal. It's act, absolutely gorgeous. If you're an opal collector, this is uh, the only time you'll actually see this material, and this was the absolute last design that we did in this material. And I designed this, I did it with uh, all the high grade material I had left over, and then I wanted to really set it off. I wanted it something that would make it pop. And so that's when I used this really high blue, that's a natural high blue, Seven Peaks turquoise. And even that turquoise um, is very rare. Um, uh, there, I have a lot of that turquoise, I have very little of it in that quality mm -hmm. that has that color, that natural color. That's like glow in the dark turquoise blue. I mean, it's just the, you know, the, 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 the way that it contrasts, right? And the, the way that it offsets it, it really makes it really eye catching. It really, the, the little turquoise stations really do it. But this is a really rare opal. Um, I guarantee you right now, I have no more. Okay. I couldn't even make this. We're the only ones that had that, that yellow opal material. There is other yellow opals out there in the world, but this Sonora material, we got everything they had. And like I said, this was, uh, this was mined over, over 20 years ago, 22 years ago, is when this was actually came out of the ground. Well, it's absolutely gorgeous. And, you know, I can see Angie wearing it across the room. And, you know, I've got it, it on. It's just, it's beautiful. And the contrast between the color of the turquoise and the opal jade, like what you were saying, is that's really, really beautiful. I mean, this looks like a vacation on your neck, which is what we all want to be doing. Um, I know we've only got, like, about a minute and a half left in the show. Uh, so we've got so many gorgeous items. This show has flown by so fast. Don't forget about FlexPay. That's any major credit card you could take the total amount of an item and pay it off over time however we ship with the very first payment for example if you get this necklace seventeen dollars and 39 cents that's your flex pay uh seventeen dollars and 39 cents but that you give us that and then you get the necklace right away we, you, you're already enjoying the necklace for a month before your second flex pay comes up on whatever card you originally put the first flex pay. So it's just a really great way to just enjoy something, not break the bank. I mean, it's one thing to budget $86 into a month. It's another thing to budget $17.39 into a month. And so if you really want to treat yourself, this is definitely the day to do it. 094177. I want to thank our beautiful model, Angie, for doing an amazing job. Jay, always a thrill. I know you and 
high, I think, are together on Monday between one and three. We've uh, switched around a little bit, and I'm, I'm going to be doing the one o'clock hour on Monday, and I know that I'm going to be with you then, but um, maybe you have shows before then. But yes, I got uh, actually tonight at 10 o'clock. Okay. Adam and I are going to finish up on the Today Special. So you got two, Adam, uh, two hours of Adam and I. We're going to have a lot of fun, and I hope you can take the time to tune in and watch. It's going to have a lot of new and different. But Adam and I always have a lot of fun, and I always love working with Helen, and we are going to be working on Monday. In fact, I, that's why I got the text message that um, that they uh, we're going to punish you a little bit more and make you do another <laughs> no, I, show. No, I begged so them. So see, I you've said, been please. a very bad girl, and you're going on vacation, <laughs> and now they're making you pay for it. You're paying for this. <laughs> no. I said, is there any way I can <laughs> squeeze in one more show with Jay before I go on vacation? And they're like, no problem. Um, we're going to take a break. When we come back, I see Sarah standing by, and she's ready for Christmas in July, so stay tuned. This year, we're ready to party. It's our birthday. And we have 44 reasons to celebrate. Come join the fun for our 44th birthday month. Cue the confetti. We're celebrating our birthday throughout July with even more. New guests. New shows. And new favorites you are gonna love. Plus, that wouldn't be a birthday without some prizes all month long. The party is on. Our 44th birthday continues all month long on HSN and at hsn.com. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900.